I have to do it. What are you talking about? I have to prove my title. Current problem? Uh, no, the other one. Oh, you must be an amateur voice actor. Uh, no, the other, other one. Dirtbag Pope? What? No, I prove that every day over on Bird App. I mean, King of Card Games. Uh, but, but that's not even in the Twitter bio anymore. Doesn't matter. I still have a title to defend. <sighs> alright, alright. So, what Yu-Gi-Oh game are you going to be working through to prove that you're the... And I mean heavy air quotes here... Champ. <laughs> ah, my dear Aster. Tell me, what is a king if he's only good at a single card game? For to truly claim my title as king of games, I must prove that I am good at every card game imaginable. So, I'm going to start with Duel Masters Kaijudo Showdown. What? You mean, like, Duel Masters? That super dead card game? Yeah. This can end well. So, Duel Masters Kaijudo Showdown is a GBA game from... Oh. Oh god. Oh. Oh god, this game is from 2004. Hmm. So this is what getting old feels like. I think so, Aster. I think so. So, in this game, you play as one of five characters. Your standard red, gold member, Tumblr's abomination, suburban dad ready to cut the grass, and finally, the piece de resistance, the character I chose to be my avatar throughout this entire playthrough, Edgy the Hedgy, otherwise known as Tom. So, the game starts with your brother leaving on a, um, archaeology trip, of all things. Yes, because this man, a man who looks like this, likes archaeology. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. I mean, it's really not fine, but we don't have time for this because we've got to get into some card games. So before your brother leaves on his archaeology trip, he hands you his Duel Masters collection and then tasks you with being the very best. Which, you know... I gotta do it because I guess that's just the goal of the game. So I decide to head to my local card shop where I decide to purchase a new deck. Because I do not by any means trust this game to start me out with a usable deck without spending some in-game points. So I decided to go ahead and buy the light deck. Because yes, this man, this wonderful avatar I have chosen right here, uses a light deck. So anyway, here's how the first tournament went. Here we go, first tournament. So nervous. Right, here we are. Single elimination? Can we do it? I certainly hope so. Let's go with Tails. Tails never fails, baby. Yeah, let's go first. I summon my upside down rat. Hey, let me summon my spaghettio. Right, let's kill each other. Uh oh, spaghettios. All right. Good luck attacking when you don't have a monster. Damn it! It's back! I do not like this. Okay, I think we're gonna skip the mana selection for this turn and summon an apple core. Not letting you take out my one hitter. However, that could be 
theoretically problematic. Ah, God, my rats, no! In fact, I'm gonna summon out a second Apple Core. By my opponent. Haha, -ha, you fool! You cannot defeat me! You can't beat me. I've got an apple core on my side. What do you have? Also, I have spaghetti. Deal with it. Okay, so that did not go as expected. Oh! Spinning Wheel of Death, okay. Okay, we're gonna go R and we're gonna summon an Apple Core. Let's go. Okay, I'm starting to sense a problem with my deck. I think it's that it's full of mostly defender creatures. And that is a problem. I guess that's the only one I can take out. Let's see what happens. Once again, Apple Core for the win. Don't mess with an apple. Clearly. An apple a day does in fact keep the doctor away. I'm gonna go all out and summon my disco ball. And you're toast. Face the light, buddy. Step into that light. I barely escaped that with my head. Right. Okay, I'm gonna make a prediction. My opponent's gonna be using a darkness deck next. Okay, I'm gonna go with Tails. Of course I wanna go first. These two just take each other out. Kamikaze style right there. But worth it, as my army remains almost untouched and I break a shield. Ah, biscuits. Oh, he just got some more cards in his hand. Okay. Behold this thing! Yes, it's a monstrosity. Deal with it. Right? Oh. I mean, not that it matters. You're still gonna have to step into the light. You know, deal with it. I filled his dark soul with light, guys. It's, it's chill. Okay, so, grand finale round, guys. Okay. I'm assuming the guy I'm fighting is gonna be named Nigel. Let's duel, my guy. Tails never fails. Booyah. And I will summon out my spinning wheel. Gonna need to get more of the spinning wheels. Have them replace the weird bean card that I have. Let's see where he's going with... Okay, so he's offered me an egg in this trying time. Okay, I'll sacrifice my apple core. They have murdered each other. Oh, his name is actually Baby. It was not 
wasn't anticipating that turn of events at all. Alright. Let's see where else this goes. Oh dear. Alright, and next turn he's finished. What is that thing? Oh no, that isn't his name. That was the name of his monster. Okay, so he still may in fact be Nigel. There's a good chance his name is going to be Nigel. Okay, I summon out my Disco Ball. I'm an emissary of hell. Embrace the light. I ween. I, I won the tournament, guys. Are you proud of me? I, I finally did an accomplishment. Now, what's my reward? Right. So, after round one, I was feeling pretty good about this deck. But I had two more tournaments to get through. So, I decided before I could start my second one, I needed to fix up my light deck and make it a little bit better. And that's when I discovered something terrible. Horrifying, even. You can't fully customize your deck. That's right, I couldn't figure out how the trunk works. Like they have it, I just couldn't figure out how it worked at this time. So I used one of the presets that are basically handed to you, the, specifically the Fire and Darkness preset. And thank god I started save scumming around this point. Let's kick some butt and chew some bubblegum. Right. I don't want to jinx it, but I think I kind of got this in the bag. I may not, in fact, have this in the bag. Like I would have hoped. Now I think I got this. Your stalling won't protect you forever. And here's proof. Behold! Infinite darkness will consume thee! We're going tails. And I'm dueling a Girl Scout. This is not gonna end well for me, is it? Still, anyone's match at this point, let's be entirely honest. Come on, destroy each other, destroy each other! Fudge. Ah, no. Oh, yikes. Well, I'm gonna be honest, I'm right screwed, aren't I? I'm sorry, what was that animation? What? Just... just... what? There is still hope. Okay, and... Okay. Let's hope this pays off. Because if she just attacks me directly, I'm kind of screwed. You see, kids, this is why we save scum. All the time. 
because yikes. That's a that's a major yikes from me. Behold the power of save scumming. I mean, doing it all first try, never failing. We're going heads. Yes. No, but I believe you're my s treasured spider bot. Oh no, you're instead just a giant fuck off spider. Behold the power of a giant fuck off spider. And they destroy each other, because of course they do. Why must my fuck off spider fail? Me? Slayer, when this creature loses a battle, destroy the other creature. Oh, hell yes! Give me more of this guy, please. I am an edgelord of the highest degree. Right. Now then. Set your heart ablaze. Get it? Get it? Because I set her on fire! I am hilarious. Right. Right-o. Right-o. It's time for all of the marbles. Remember, it's not scummy if the game is bad. Oh, he's going first. Oh dear. What the hell is that thing? Okay, okay, okay. That's gonna be a large yikes from me, but... Okay. What? Well, I've just screwed... I've just right fucked myself. Damn it. Well, this match is a bust, but I'm still gonna do the honorable thing and let him d try to destroy me. Because of honor. And the fact that I'm just going to save scum my way back here. Do I have anything that just... You know what? I'm gonna be honest. I have to surrender. Because I really can't beat him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not taking your consolation prize. And we're about to find out that other way. Hell yes. Tails never fails. This is the first time I'm doing this. Oh, yeah. Biscuits. Mm. Yeah, this is not coming up Mealhouse, not gonna lie. Yeah, well, I've lost this, that's for damn sure. Now he's just laying it on for good measure. Screw this guy, am I right? I mean, the nerve of some people. I just want to play a fun little card game, and he's like, nah. Nah, my vines are going to infest your intestines. <laughs> well, unfortunately for him, I'm willing to make sacrifices. And he puts another fucking brick wall in my way? What the hell, man? That is not cash money. Okay, that is not at all cash. He summons another 4,000 shield?
Okay. 1100. God, I hate Will so much. Honestly, would have been useful last turn if I had read the fine print. But I'm a moron, so I didn't. So I'm pretty sure this is going to be the last turn this round. Because... And you see, kids, that is why you have shields installed. Shut it. I don't care. We're gonna try this again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. Just, just, just shut up, game, please. Okay, let's hit continue. I'm definitely not getting frustrated at all. Can I change my deck, please? Ah, no, can't. I, I guess I'm stuck like this. Darn it, Tails. Because the AI just genuinely has a better deck than me at this point, because I can't access my card customization. This is fine! As you can see, I'm getting a little bit frustrated. Because you literally cannot customize your deck to your heart's content like you can in literally every other card game. I am not salty at all. Wait a minute, is the game about to let me win? I'm gonna be so- You know, I was about to say, I'm gonna be so insulted if it just like lets me win here. Oh, the game thinks it's being clever. It's like, ah, oh, no, I see. Oh, it's forcing me to attack. Honestly, yeah, it kind of figures that's the price I pay for uh, fire monsters. They kind of all have to attack the turn they can. Okay. Set your mother fucking heart ablaze, bitch! Burn, baby, burn! As you can tell, <clears throat> I was definitely not at all frustrated. I don't know what you're talking about. That went off first try without a hitch. Clearly the first try. <clears throat> Ignore me getting progressively angry over restarts. That never happened. It's false. It's fiction. It does not exist. I am gaslighting you now. It never happened. Thank you. Right. And then Tournament 3 happened. But before I started that one, I went ahead and I bought the Fire Booster Pack because I found that I really liked the Fire Deck. And whoo! boy. Or I guess just as Shobu intended. What is that design? Look at his face. Look at those glasses. This man 
that man pulls all the tail. Just all of it. And by pull tail, I mean he goes up to dog and yanks their tails. He's an asshole. Fuck that kid, man. Fuck him. See what he's got. He's pulling a darkened fire deck. Hello, Daniel. Alright, let's just get you off the battlefield right now. Mutually assured destruction style. We're getting all mad up in here. Oh. Oh, he's trying to win. What is this? This is some absolute bullshit right here. Thomas and friends have never seen such bullshit. Go on, mad, mad, mad. Aw, oh, no mad. Ah, uh -uh, it's not cash money. What? 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 And he eyeballs me. Damn it. See, I told you. This kid is an asshole. Fuck that kid. No one likes him. Right? Let's just bop. The immortal Baron Vorg is not very immortal. Gonna be honest. Damage. Oh god, he's using wizard money gang tactics. They love casting spells. <laughs> he thought. He really thought. I can burn up my card and burn up your card. Now then. Burn alive, you hellspawn. I may get a little carried away with fire, not gonna lie. Remember, kids, always play with fire. It will never go wrong. Never, ever, ever go wrong. You. You son of a bitch. <laughs> Lord, buddy, I'm sorry. Your immortality is lost yet again. I am so sorry. It didn't need to be this way, man. I'm so sorry. Right, let's wipe that off the face of the map right here, right now. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Race hail, praise Dale, as they say. Alright, let's see what else he's got. Oh, that guy's gonna have a whale of a time! Get, get it? Cause, cause he's a whale. It's funny. Cause he's a whale. Laugh! See how easy this is when I have a functioning deck that I'm familiar with? I'm a lot better. Maybe fire is just my element. <gasps> no, wait. I have a more perfect line. I am in my element. Get it? Because he's burning alive like he deserves. Yeah, I did it. Let's go. Oh my god, I'm dueling a guy from the 70s. He's just so cool. He looks like the standard big brother from every, like, Disney TV show ever made. Like, specifically that big brother that's supposed...
supposed to be cool. Or maybe, like, the cousin you don't see much, but he's always depicted as supposed to be, like, way too cool. Did I up the difficulty without realizing? What? Okay, okay, you know what? It's fine. It's actually not fine, but, you know, I'll live. Because the Immortal Baron is back, baby. That damn thing. Fudge that. Okay, now Humpty Dumpty can go fuck himself. Oh, I will say that. Creatures with less than 4,000. Well, well, well. I do declare. That's gonna be quite useful. Right there. I think we're gonna get rid of you. Okay, and he just summoned a Demon King out of nowhere. Okay, we mad at each other there. How will he continue this show up? Okay. Hopefully he doesn't immediately go for game. Shit, he's going for game. Damn it. Well, shows what I know. So, after the amazing and epic final battle, I lost. But I was informed immediately after the tournament that my new card shop was going to officially sponsor me to take a trip to the next city over. So, I was like, that's pretty cool. I got sponsored. This is where I would put an ad read if I was popular enough to have a sponsorship. But I don't! So we're gonna skip that part for now. Anyway, I was approached by this guy. Eh, I don't know, he might come back later. <laughs> Who the... I think I just had a miniature stroke trying to process this guy's outfit. I can't tell if he looks like Bob Ross, the cult leader, or just someone who needs to shave. Or maybe he's just Albert Einstein secretly trying to disguise himself in a card game anime. What is going on? Hey, I've been watching you duel. You're really good. Um, do I know you? Stranger Danger Dave, run! <laughs> Okay, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that. Friend of your brother's. Oh, you know my brother? Absolutely. Sam is the greatest duelist I've ever known. He and I used to trade... Trade quite a bit. Do you still duel? Not... Not so much anymore. I still enjoy duel masters, but I'm more of a collector now. Neat. Well, I've gotta get going. The bus is about to take to my first regional. Good luck to you. Perhaps I'll see you when you return. In the meantime, take this card as a congratulatory gift. Maybe you can make use of it in one of your tournament decks. Um, can't accept gifts from strangers, but thanks anyway. Anyway, it was time to claim my destiny as a duel master. So, I decided to catch my bus. While I was on the bus, I managed to discover an amazing new ability. An ability that would completely destroy any enemies that ever come my way. I figured out how to use the trunk! It was time to take on the entire fire civilization on my own. And this time, it was as good as done because I had the trunk and could exploit the game to the fullest! Spoiler alert, I'm bad at card games. Alright, let's get started. Gonna go Tails. Wow. Oh. Well, this is not gonna be fun. Okay, so she just starts out with Clock Resonator. Right. right. Let's take this guy down. 
Kaboomy. Honestly, she could probably go for game this turn, if we're being honest. There it is. Dang it. Yeah, you see, that's what happens when you get a bad hand. But we're going first this time. And since it's best two out of three, we should eventually get something good. I'm being... The Immortal Baron Vorg. Let's see how that immortality holds up, buddy. Jesus Christ, Vorg, your Im immortality is complete shit. Let's get you out on the field. And you and I are gonna destroy each other. Kaboom. <laughs> For equals in strength. Well, well, I believe that's game. Yep, that, my friends, is game. First round, ouch, you should prepare more before you try again. That is hurtful, but I agree. Luckily, I do have a plan. Card shop, take me away. Oh, so that's how you get to the trunk. Okay. Okay, okay, I see what we're doing now. Look at how fast that went by. Wowzers. Same girl, first round. Okay, let's go. Yes, I want to go first. Why would I not want to go first? Okay, lady. Now you're going down. Duh and duh. Alright, let's get you off the field right now. <coughs> Kablooey. Right, I got a good feeling about this now. That's right. I figured out how the trunk works. Wahahaha! <laughs> Oh, go ahead and try. I've already won this round. Ha 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 ha! Soon you will burn in the abysmal flame. Right. Say goodnight! Ha 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 Right. Let's see what happens next. Right. Sweet, I got two options. First round. And I'll send you out first. And then... Immortal Baron Vorg, don't fail me now! You've got this, buddy! The Immortal Baron will never let me down. Okay. So, this should kamikaze him, if not win. <laughs> Aha! I ween! I'm a gonna ween! <laughs> Jesus, Vorg, you have one job! To survive! To be immortal! And you are not immortal! You are literally the exact opposite of a mortal, my guy. Right. Yep. 
Yeah, let's take you out, because you seem to be the one that will cause the most amount of problems for me. And unless she summons something for shield, next round should be game. One guy. Say good night. Haha, <laughs> victory for David. Let's go. Right, ranking up in the world. Da ba da 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 da. And I'm fighting a girl scout. What are the odds? Okay, we're gonna save and continue. I will save scum my way through this entire game if I have to. Nothing will stop me. Tails. Hell yeah. I'm going first. Uh, okay, for now. Let's summon him out. Yes, pass turn. Right. Right, and assuming. Oh, it's a. Oh, it is a light and fire deck. Yikes. Okay, I may have a problem on my hands. Where is my egg? I desire my egg. Cast Tornado Flame. Gets rid of her. And that's game, baby! Let's go! Okay, and she's going first. Oh, she brought out the Flying Rat first. Excuse me, is that a tumor? Did this woman just play a tumor? What the actual fu- It's fine, Dave. It's fine. It's not fine. It's weird. Alright, me and the tumor killed each other, I guess. That's weird that you summoned out a tumor. Tumor like that, I don't understand. Vorg, you got us into this mess. And now I'm being forced to get us out. Well, at least the rat's out of the picture now. Okay, okay, now we're back in business. Didn't match. You know, a fair fight, for the most part. But I was not expecting the fire and light combo. Yes, I'm going first this time. Okay, gonna need the tornado of flame. Okay, get my one-hitter out, first and foremost. Okay, let's get you out the way right now. Because we are not Scooter Brothers. We are not brothers on scooters. Okay. 
Okay, what's gonna happen here? Ha <laughs> ha! An apple a day will not keep this doctor away. After all, you're gonna be toast? Huh? 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 <laughs> okay, screw you guys. That was clever. I'm keeping that in. Okay, you weren't running on last hope strats. Too bad for you. Tell me. Do you know what it's like to burn, baby? Burn! Ha ha! Yee. It won another round. That's right, we're going on to the final round of the fireplace. Okay, it's time to set your heart ablaze, guys. We're gonna save one more time. All right. Let's burn this fucker to the ground. Heads. Oh, he's going first. Oh no. Game was rigged from the very start. Yeah, 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 let's get this ground pound over with. And naturally I get overtaken by nature. Yes, I want to go first. If all goes as planned, next turn I should be able to go for get... Is that supposed to be a turtle? I, I don't know if that's supposed to be a turtle or not. What? What is that? Which one's gonna be more of a problem, I think? Right. Well, I've probably lost this. Is that an angel from Evangelion? What? What is that? Ah, uh, yeah, I've lost this. Oh, uh, yikes. Yep, there it is. That's right, we're save scumming. To the very end. Tails. Yes, I want to go first. I want to ensure this victory. Right. Got this, this round. The Wolfman, no! How could you? I thought we were buddies back in Transylvania. Wait, Dracula is tra Wait, is the Wolfman Transylvania? I think he is, but I'm not sure. Either way, set your heart ablaze, my guy. Booyah. I do not like this little glass frog. Little grass little glass frog. Takes the hose. Oh. Splish splash. I have taken a bath. Right. And this is where he kills me. Note, that was a bad move. <sighs> right. Naturally, 
natural snare. Right, anyway, I'm a gonna win. I claim victory, baby. Let's go. Finally. Ah, we did it, chat. Well, not not chat because I'm not streaming, but I did it. I am the Duel Masters Grand Champion of the Fire Dimension. Well, Fire Civilization. You get the idea. I did it. Congratulations! You won the Inferno. Won the Infernal Invitational. That's quite an achievement given the competition. The tournament host said, she, said he wanted to meet the winner, so you should go talk to him before you do. Here is a well-deserved prize. Also, please accept the super rare card from the Evo Doom Expansion Armor Blaster. Oh. Hey, yo! Nice! And it was then, with my victory in hand, I took on my last challenge. I needed to defeat one more person. And then I could be the true king of the Fire Nation. I mean, the Fire Civilization. Yeah, that, that's what I meant. That was the part that was in the script, definitely. Okay, I, I guess I have to go home. Ah. Oh! I am. You must be Dave. I saw you in the tournament. You have a very impressive playing style. Thank you. Is there anything I can do for you? Yeah, Knight said I should talk to you. He said that you might have some important information about the fire civilization. Knight sent you. Then you must trust... Then he must trust you. However, before I can give you information you seek, you must prepare yourself by defeating me. Ah, uh, shit. I, I was not ready for this at all. Okay, let's go with that. Okay, and let's summon out the Immortal Baron. He's never failed us. Never. Never once in our life has he ever failed. I do like how sprite work is unique. He, he's obviously one of the guys from the intro, pretty clearly, but still. Kind of a... kind of a fun little thing. Blaze Ken. Oh. Uh, okay, so we just gave him a power boost is all. Wow. That is unfortunate. Okay, and hopefully next round will be game, assuming he doesn't have any spells. Right. Well, I'm gonna be honest, this was unnervingly easy. Say goodnight! Wait, did I just kill Rengoku again? Oh, it's best two out of... Oh, okay. Vorg, you've never failed me. At all. Never. Got this, you immortal son of a- Huh. This may not bode well for me. Hmm. Okay, I don't need two of those in my hands. 
my nice egg is right here. All I'm ever gonna need. What is that thing? Like, holy Jesus. Okay. I see. Shadow Wizard Money Gang. He loves casting spells. What? What in the name of shit? What just happened? Okay, yep. We'll kill each other there. Then my egg will just kapow. He has an egg of his own? What is this blasphemy? Well, joke's on him. I have a dragon. Get ready for some dragon tails, best buddy. Okay, cast. And now my dragon wins. Hey! <laughs> Congratulations, you handle your cards well. I can see that you've turned your deck for my fast fire attack. Thank that that was a great tool. You've proven yourself worthy to receive the information you seek. I have sent the information you've requested to your pocket gizmo. Your uh, excuse me, it seems I have a heartburn and I can't find my So so we're all aware that equated to, like, nothing, right? Like, actually nothing. And so, I did it. I won my first big tournament. There was just one small itty-bitty issue. There were actually more tournaments that I needed to win. In fact, there was one for each of the major civilizations in the game. Un so, unfortunately, that's gonna have to wait till next time as I'm kind of running out of... Okay, okay, slow down. You do realize no one actually plays Duel Masters anymore, right? Wait, what? Yeah, the game kind of failed to catch on in the West. I think it's still going on in Japan, but... I can't read Japanese at the moment, so I really wouldn't know. All I really have are secondhand sources at the time. But... But how? It, it, it... The game just seemed like such a big deal back in the day. Um, actually, I may be of some assistance here. Aster? Buddy? When did we get a new roommate? Oh, no, no, no. Do not pin this guy on me. Right then, where are my manners? My name is D. Well Masters, at your service. I'm a card game historian. Aster, Aster, buddy, I I'm gonna need you to finish this one out. I need to go scream into a wall and bust my head open. I'll be back soon. I am. So lost. Right, so to fully understand why Duel Masters never exactly caught on in the West, first we must talk about the Great Card Game War of 2000 AD to 2011 AD. You see, during the Great Card Game War, Duel Masters looked like a promising up and comer, but presumably, it fell at the feet of Magic the Gathering and Yu-Gi-Oh! as it was a combination of both games. 
The card game was presumed as a casualty of the Great War, but as a twist of fate would turn out, in the West, during the year of 2012 AD, the card game would resurface in the year 2012 AD, but it was quickly put down once more, as the group that survived was a small group barely rumored to exist. They still in some capacity are rumored to exist, but some say these fans exist on either a Reddit of some kind, or a Discord that's out there somewhere in the distance. It's rumored they went underground after the Great Kaijudo Massacre of 2012. But regardless of where they are, we know they're out there. And we are awaiting another spectacular failure to return. They are never coming back. <laughs>